This was on the last trip we were to Israel, and they were uncovering David's palace. Ooh. So I, they had some broken pieces of pottery that they gave us, and it was this trip was just like a. There was six of us. He, Rick wasn't heading up a trip. We just went with some friends, and so we were able to go where the other crew, team couldn't go. And so they were digging and unearthing different pieces of pottery. So this was actually during David's day. Ooh. Ooh. So this is actually, I mean, it's broken, but it's a handle of a cup. Mm. Yeah. Wow. So isn't that cool? Amazing. Yes, yeah. very cool. Yeah. And then there was just more, more pieces. And I've got them written on here. So amazing. You know. But I think about the broken pieces in Psalms 34 and 18 when he says, God is near to a broken heart. Wow. And he saves are such that are, as a, that are a contrite spirit, which means to be crushed. And, you know, when I was working on that, uh, um, the sculpture of Lincoln, it's interesting, but as long as I, I could keep it softened, you know, even once it got hardened, and I noticed, like, if it was, if, if I could just, you know, if I crushed it, I could soften that and, and make it and form something else out of it again. And that's what he does. Sometimes we feel broken until we're crushed. And he says, but we're not discarded. Mm -hmm. You know, and understand when we're broken, we're open. We're ready. We're humbled when we're ready to receive him. But how he, he doesn't throw us away, but he, he makes us over again to a new vessel. But anyway, yeah, this, I just said, remembered I had all this stuff in my trunk. Well, I still like what you saw. Make sure to comment and like below. Hit that subscribe button for more content uploaded weekly.